guys, what's up? So basically our cab has finally arrived. It's a Volkswagen one. So we are just loading our stuffs here. So one luggage done. And if you have checked my previous vlog, this is just a continuation of it. So basically we are at Amsterdam and the place that we stay at the airport is just like about 18 minutes apart. So six of us will be taking this cab. But first, let me just keep the cut here. So we're just exiting the airport. <laughs> this is how 10 p.m. at Amsterdam looks like. So bright. <laughs> hostel and then just doing our check-in this is basically the lobby area of our hostel and so beautiful cycles and this is the outside arena this is the bar which is located at our hotel thank you so much thank you no worries okay. so just did my check-in wanted to see if this was the right hostel and now let me just go and collect my bag and after that head to the room for my keys so guys this is like almost 10 pm in amsterdam and look how bright it is wow so let's collect my luggage and i'm so sorry if i look so oily and dirty and greasy right now because i travel for like basically two days straight so we're just taking my suitcase and heading to the sixth floor of So let's check in the room. We just reached the hotel or the hostel and this is basically the view from outside the hostel. So basically this is the hostel where we will be residing and this is my bed on the base, bed number two and we have an amazing view on the outside. So we're just going to go out for dinner. These are our lockers and this is me. reception arena of our hostel and this is how it looks so we are going out for dinner towards the exit the bicycles which you can take on hire just outside the FIA hostel basically it's not VIA but FIA hostel and let's find our way navigate along shut right now so we have to basically order from uber eats either we go to downtown but we're too tired today so maybe we'll order something from uber eats it's currently 12 so basically Bhutan must be around 4 a.m and that is pretty much it i'm so tired i'm just gonna go to my room shower and like crash because basically i've been running on no sleep and no proper food for the past two days i really need to fuel up so yeah guys, this is the outside of our hotel. Basically, I thought it was a hostel, but it's a hotel, Fia Hotel. So I'll see you all tomorrow. I'm super tired today. Good night. And sorry if I look greasy and oily, but I'm too tired to even care right now. Good morning guys. So just came down to the reception for breakfast. There's a lot of variety of meat here. Some pickles. came here to get some eggs so basically I have a butter bread and I'm just gonna pick up an egg here why is my egg like pink in color anywho let's get going this one just try this one as well 
think this is toast bacon toasted bacon I suppose I don't want to have this I guess it's a similar taste so what I'll go for is some cheese some European cheese and I guess that's pretty much it so let's look for a table now this is mango and this one's like peach iced tea I suppose so let's get it how come every time we talk you act like you're too cool A hearty breakfast and holding my Nespresso coffee and just came out to chill and feel the cold breeze. Basically the plan for today is to hit the central. Either we'll take the metro or the bus and also I'll check out the university where I'm supposed to join from tomorrow for my summer class. So let's see the distance and get equipped with the areas around. Anywho guys, once I'm done with this, we'll head downtown and I'll take you guys along with me. I hope you're having a wonderful day and I'll see you in a few minutes. Bye-bye. Has you entangled in a chimera of a dream? So you weep and cry by yourself to sleep at night Now fear consumes your mind What if I'm not too caught up for this life? Currently at the train station Waiting to get our cards, metro cards And from there we have to head in Swipe a card, head in and head to Amsterdam Central Station Since we are going downtown so just got my metro travel card it's called the chip card and 7.50 euros for this and then you have to add further balance finally at the platform waiting for our train and it's an open platform basically and the weather is so chill so we are currently i guess here and we have to go all the way up to central station m52 so i guess it's about like 10 or 11 minute train ride just waiting for our, the next train because our friends are still like left behind so we missed this train anywho i guess the next train will arrive in 11 minutes so we have to wait for another yeah, 11 minutes i, I, I will meet you guys downtown basically this is the first view of Amsterdam city this is the first time I'm here and this is the first view that I see and it looks beautiful with all the interior and their architect designs super beautiful and this is basically downtown and they have this beautiful canal tour just next to the central station at the heart of downtown so beautiful then you said don't you be afraid of when your life's gonna end you should be the structure the architect designs oh my lord 
it is super beautiful and this just makes me feel like the world is so big and we shouldn't limit ourselves and should travel, explore and just enjoy the world. <laughs> First I have to buy a SIM card and then I also need to get a charger head because the one I got like I mentioned it doesn't work in Europe at all and because of that the weather is pleasant, super beautiful. They have amazing packages to visit. Let me show you guys. Canal cruises, excursions, ice bar, please believe it or not, Madame Tussauds, museums. So they have a pretty good deal and it's located just next to the central station. Must check out. Me and you're half asleep and I can count each freckle and see all your beauty. That's the damn cheese stars. Wow, good job. Interior just in the heart of the town. Wow, don't worry, it'll never begin. So, as far as life, this is the mall by the name D. Bonjour, and they have Mac, Charlotte Tilbury, and I see a lot of cheese stores, must try. And this is the Torrent ticket, similar to this one, KFC. This is the other part of downtown and they have this beautiful river flowing through the canal and how pretty is this? currently at this market which is located just next to downtown basically in downtown and I need a tote bag for tomorrow it's just like four euros to go to university since I have to carry my laptop so let's look for some pretty colors this is pretty cigarette cases and they have a huge variety of stuff Just exploring the market here, I got a nice container, a tote bag and my charger head jaw was like literally having such a hard time because I didn't have it and now we're just at the market basically, Amsterdam shirts and the market is quite outstretched till the end, this is the next store we are going to, really pretty Cherries. Guys, so we're just walking on the streets. Me and Chimi, basically, we have no idea where we're going. We're just going by our gut and exploring the city of Amsterdam. And for now, we have no idea where we are. But it's kind of fun to look around the market and check things out. And after a while, we'll head for lunch to I don't know where. So yeah, guys, that is the update for now. The city is just so beautiful and lovely. Really nice must visit <laughs> jolly joker the jolly joker we are basically literally going into the streets and exploring by ourselves so much confidence for two people who've never been into the city and don't know the language this is wow. our next stop at the souvenir face let's check out what they have i'm 
Ooh, this is nice. Bottle opener, knife, cute souvenir stall around the corner. That was one interesting store. Anywho guys, now we are in search of a good restaurant and looking for something delish. And post that, maybe we'll look around again and then head to clear. This is a Malaysian restaurant and we are looking for something rice to have lunch. And they have vegan available chicken curry soup with it's rice. the fresh juice they have. And this is basically the restaurant setting. Oh, the so the lunch menu that they have is roti with dal, soup curry, ayam, chicken curry. Cheers guys! Done with our lunch and we are still exploring the city. We are here at the store to just look for a water bottle. And basically this is it. Currently we are walking towards the canal tour. They are offering it for 10 euros and 9 euros for one hour guided boat tour. And this is the open boat, so let's head towards the ticket counter. Welcome on board, one hour, 10 euros adult. Excuse me, down? Thank you. So let's head towards the ticket space. So welcome on board. <laughs> sure, ticket. Thank you. Whoa. So we are finally on the boat. Hi guys, we are finally on the canal boat. <laughs> So we're just waiting for our boat to take off. We have some cherry juice and now let's wait. Got a perfect seating arena and so full from lunch. And just settled myself here. Hi, so we are finally on the canal boat. Got a ticket for 10 euros per person and settled ourselves in. We're just waiting for our boat to take off. So exciting. We're going to see the entire city of Amsterdam. This Heiligen Nikolaus. This is our guided tour. They're just talking about this church and built by Saint Nicholas, one of the prime landmarks here. Tower of Weeping, where people would wave off to their loved ones while on the ship here. house with a thousand windows it's basically when people couldn't afford to live in apartments they had to live in this houseboats but apparently now it's considered like a luxury and it's really expensive to stay in one of those houseboats that you see uh, the apartments where people reside for them to move houses efficiently so basically the luggages are passed through in the houses from the windows down Hello. cycling is the best and the fastest way to get through Amsterdam things like in Amsterdam there are more bicycles than residents basically we are still at the canal tour and it's pretty amazing when you actually stand up and watch the view 
floating Chinese restaurants, copy of the one that is located at Hong Kong. We have finally come towards the end of our camel boat cruise. How was it, Jimmy? It was really nice. And we enjoyed a lot. And now we're exiting the camp. I just realized I did close the vlog. Day one was super tiring and exhausting, but also amazing. And just came to know that UNESCO has actually declared Amsterdam as a World Heritage Tourist Site. So amazing, it's a beautiful city. Anywho, I have to like sleep now. It's 11 o'clock because tomorrow I have to reach my university by 8.45 a.m. And for that I have to leave by 7.30 and for that I have to get up at 6 a.m. It's like so difficult to sleep early in Amsterdam because the sun doesn't go down before 11 p.m. So it's still so bright. Anywho guys, good night and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.